Hey everyone, how's it going? Elliot here from The Retro Future. I just got a message from one of my Patreons, Matthew, who I actually met in Play Expo Manchester last year. Hi Matthew, how you doing? Um, and he has made me a Game Boy game. He has made me a Game Boy game, not just like a game that has my logo on it or something like that. This is an actual game that we're going to play today on the channel. Before we do that, I need to give a few shout outs to some of the people that's made all of this crazy stuff happen. First things first, big thank you to Cloner Alliance for sending me the Cloner Alliance Box Pro. It's a capture card that allows me to record straight onto a USB stick and then I can take that out, chuck it into a laptop and do my editing. It's a really, really good device. It came with this fantastic cable that is very attractive to retro enthusiasts like myself. We've got composite and RGB, as well as it obviously has HDMI in as well. So it's just a fantastic capture card. I couldn't find any other capture cards that did um, RGB and composite as well. So really, really helpful for me to have that. Uh, second of all, big shout out to Noble. Um, for making the DMTV. They're the same guys who make these tiny little Raspberry Pi Game Boys. And uh, yeah, big shout out to him. I'll leave all of their details in the description below. This piece of wood basically has a Game Boy PCB mounted on the front of it with an EverDrive GB attached to it and also four uh, AA's in this little battery pack soldered into the power input and then there's the DMTV. Uh, this is a prototype development version. The final version is gonna have HDMI out. It's got a audio cable running straight into the Cloner Alliance box. I've got my headphones coming out of the Cloner Alliance box which means it's gonna record audio as well. This doesn't have a speaker in it, this little monitor, so I'm gonna have to listen to it through the headphones. And then it uses an NES controller port. Uh, so I did film a bit of footage of me assembling all of that, but yeah, very cool stuff. It's very complex. I could have just done some emulation and screen capped it, but I thought this would be a bit cooler. So I'm going to play the game on this little monitor with my headphone in and using my NES controller. I'm going to hit record now. Here we go. I cannot believe someone has made a game of the retro future. So exciting. Right, so there's my logo. I don't know how he's even managed to put that there, but that's awesome. That is the text font that Holly, um, the artist, um, has done, Holly the illustrator. And then he's used it again, and it's called The Hunt for the Mega Duck. So this is awesome, and there he is at the bottom, at Matthew Begg. Um, again, I'll leave all of the details below to find uh, all of the guys in this video. So here we go, so there's my studio, look. So there's my shelf. Um, so we've got some games on there maybe and a, a little console up there and then we've got a Walkman definitely. There's my, uh, my artwork that Lines of Thought did and then also the sign that Emily got me for my birthday on air. We've got some info, there's me with my little hat on and uh, there's my table so that's awesome. So it says I've got to record a video, I've got a video to record but there's no camera and nothing on the table. Bloody hell that would be very bad. So what can we do in here then? I can walk around, great picture. That is a great picture. Not on air at the moment. Well, I actually am, but not in the game. Still can't find that camera. And what are these? Look at how I move. Like, look, the hat moves as well. What the hell is this? <laughs> Elliot, you're meant to be recording videos. Where is that mega duck? I don't know. I cannot tell you right now. Right, and what does this one tell me? Uh, you'll need help to find your Mega Dark. I sure will. Press start to see your missions. Okay. Wow. Unearth the Mr. Sheen. Get screwdriver set. Show isopropyl alcohol to Emily. Meet Bizarro Elliot. Who's Bizarro Elliot? A duck mix up and find the Mega Duck. Okay, cool. Right, can we do anything over here? Ah, my Sony TPSL2 Walkman. Hey, look at that. We've got some music going on. Right, out we go. TRF, look at that! <laughs> oh my god, look, so there's trees and there's grass and plants. This is absolutely wild. So there's a little cave in here, can we go in here? Okay, we can. Wait, ooh, that looked like it could have been Bizarro, Elliot. Alright, let's go down here and have a look. So there's some sort of a... I don't know, is that like a little dock or something? Right, let's read this info sign. 
Send things to Elliot. The Retro Future PO Box. Oh my god, he's got my freaking PO Box address on there. <laughs> That's nuts. Okay, so we need to unearth the Mr. Sheen. That's one thing, one thing we need to do. Is that Emily? Emily! Did you find the isopropyl alcohol? Not yet. No, I haven't. Keep looking. I will. Don't you worry. Right, who's this? Josh. What is Matthew looking at? Oh, is this Matthew over here? Who's Josh? Have I missed something? Matthew! Hey, look at this mega duck. That's a normal duck. Not mega enough for me. <laughs> Welcome to the Bonwee Bay in Jersey. Oh my god, that is actually a bay in Jersey. That is ridiculous. Ooh, look, I just moved the rock and there's some stairs under here. Right. Info sign. Let's see. Move the screwdriver set to the X spot. If you get stuck, come back here. Move the screwdriver set to the X spot. Ah, I see. Oh, awesome. I love these puzzles. All right, so we've got to move it here. Dude, this is absolutely nuts. How on earth has he done this? What? <laughs> what the hell? Mission complete, got the screwdriver set, sweet. There we go, get screwdriver set. Oh my God, this is unreal. This is absolutely unreal. Okay, right, so we've got the screwdriver set, so I suppose, oh my God, there's a whole new area over here. Okay, before we do that, let's meet what I can only imagine is Bizarro Elliot. So everything's in like reverse. Oh, there's a cartridge here. Save game. Wow, that's how you save the game, Jesus. I'm Bizarro Elliot, you seek the fabled mega duck. The followers on the beach smell really nice. Hint, have a wonder. Mission complete, you met Bizarro Elliot. Dude, this is so advanced, what the hell? Let's see, none of these things do anything. What about over here? No. Okay, let's go over to the beach. Look at this area. Oh my word. I suppose you can you can climb up there. You can use your screwdrivers to help. What? Oh wait, is this Okay. How do we climb up here? Cause that looks like some screwdrivers there. How do I get up here? Hmm. You can use your screwdrivers to help. Wait a minute. Oh wait, was that a bug? Was that a bug or is that it? I don't know, was that a bug, Matthew? Was that a bug? I don't know, I just walked through a wall. Maybe not. Maybe I needed the screwdriver set to get through that, and I don't know. And anyway, look, I've got the isopropyl alcohol, so I need to give that to Emily. But let's, uh, let's get back down. I don't know if that is a bug or not. Um, right, let's go down here as well. Uh, okay. So, is there anything else down here? Is there anything else in this area? I don't think so. Right, let's go back. I like this tune. Did you write this as well? This is just absolutely mad. I don't know how this has even happened. Okay, there we go. So, Emily, you found your isopropyl alcohol. You'll be filming your video in no time. Sweet. Okay, so what next? Find the mega duck. We now need to find the mega duck. Mission complete. Duck mix-up resolved. Wow. Okay, we've just got unearth the Mr. Sheen to go. Where is the Mr. Sheen? Can I speak to the duck? Maybe Matthew can help me now. Thanks, Elliot, for all the great content. Ah, oh, cheers, dude. And there's more to come. There is. That is true. Right, what are we doing now? <laughs> I need some help. Okay, so I rang Matthew, and um, I'm basically an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Which is not news for some people. Right, so Bizarro Elliot is there to give you tips throughout the game. So we're going to go back in here. And I don't know why I wrote, I, I just presumed followers. Maybe that's my ego. It's actually flowers. So Bizarro Elliot gives you hints as you play. Now, one thing Matthew also told me. So basically, we just need to f smell all these flowers. One thing Matthew also told me is there's an Easter egg in this game somewhere. So what I'm going to do is leave a link to download this ROM in the description below. And then you guys can play it, try and complete it, see how, how quickly you can complete it. Send me your times or I don't know what you want to do. Um, but if anyone finds the Easter egg, tweet me that and I'll say... Here we go, what a lovely flower! 
Hey, look, there's the Mr. Sheen bottle. Oh my god. This is an outstanding game right now, like, seriously cool. Okay, so, now we need to go back to Bizarro Elliot then and find another hint. You've completed many missions. Take a walk along the pier. Oh my god, here we go. If the, if the Mega Duck is here. <gasps> Stairs! Or is it a ladder? Oh, what is this? I want the full experience. Wow. I can finally go home and make my video. All right, let's do that. How do I get out of here? Oh, there's the camera. Okay, right, let's do this. Congratulations, Elliot. You've managed to complete all six missions. You can now continue to film great content. Game over. Game designed by Matthew Begg, created using GB Studio by Chris Maltby. Maltby? Link to that will be in the description. Subscribe to the Retro Future on YouTube. Ah, oh, thanks. Oh, man, this is so cool. I really hope you've enjoyed this little video. If you did and you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. Download this ROM and find the Easter egg. Stay at home, stay safe, look after yourselves and your families, and I'll catch you all later. Bye.